Would you believe these cookies are gluten-free? It's true! Hello my dears, Buttercup the Baking Spaniel here with an all new recipe that I think you are going to love. Everyone adores a classic chocolate chip cookie, but what if I told you we can make a gluten free version that is just as delicious? Today we will be making a chocolate chip cookie made with almond flour. Hooray! Let's get started. We will begin by combining six tablespoons of butter, make sure that's softened first, and one third cup of brown sugar into a large mixing bowl. Cream these together using an electric mixer or a whisk if you have strong arms until it becomes light in color and fluffy. Add in one egg and one teaspoon of vanilla. And combine well. Now in a separate bowl, we will sift two cups of almond flour. It's important to sift your almond flour as it has a tendency to clump together. Next, add in one half teaspoon of baking soda and one quarter teaspoon of salt. Whisk these all together. Add your flour mixture into your wet ingredients. And mix these all together well. The nice thing about working with almond flour and other gluten-free flours is that there is less worry of over mixing your dough. Regular flour develops gluten strands when mixed for a long period of time, which can cause your cookies to be tough and chewy which is why bakers always caution how much you mix your dough once the flour is added. But there's no worry of gluten formation in this dough. How handy! Our last, but definitely not least step is to add in one half cup of chocolate chips. Oh. Stragglers. And stir well. Now, if you were impatient, you could certainly bake up these cookies right now. However, I found to get the very best texture and flavor, it is recommended to chill your dough in the refrigerator for at least one hour before baking. Once your dough has chilled, drop heaping tablespoons onto a prepared baking tray. These cookies don't spread a lot, but still make sure to leave some space between each one so they don't stick together. Oh, and here is a tip to make your cookies picture perfect. I like to take a few extra chocolate chips and press them into the tops of each cookie. Doesn't that look nice? Bake your cookies at 350 degrees Fahrenheit for 11 to 15 minutes or until they are lightly browned on top. Allow to cool on the sheet for three to five minutes, then transfer to a wire rack to finish cooling. And would you look at that? Don't these look just wonderful? These cookies are soft and chewy in all the right ways, with that oh-so-distinctive chocolate chip cookie flavor most certainly present. It would be quite a challenge to eat just one of these. 
I hope you enjoyed today's tasty recipe. Be sure to let me know what you think of these cookies in the comments below. A huge thanks to my wonderful Patreon supporters for helping make these videos possible. If you like watching my videos, consider becoming a patron. Not only will you be helping fund my future baking adventures, you can also get early access to every video, see sneak peeks at my newest recipes, join an exclusive Discord chat group, and more! Much love to all of you! Until next time! Mwah!